Now to a major ABC News investigation tonight. Popular items so many families buy on Craigslist. Strollers, baby seats, dishwashers. Now the question, could some of them be putting you and your family at risk? Were they supposed to be pulled from the shelves, recalled, but still for sale on Craigslist? ABC's chief investigative correspondent, Brian Ross, teaming up with our ABC affiliates across the country. And tonight, he puts those questions straight to Craig himself. Mr. Newmark, Brian Ross from ABC, how are you? This is Craig Newmark, the founder of Craig's List, under fire today for allowing the sale of potentially dangerous products under official safety recall, something Newmark did not want to talk about. I've been encountered by Brian Ross for Ed from ABC News. It is illegal to sell a recalled product. It's still usable. But an ABC News undercover investigation with ABC stations across the country found a wide range of them for sale on Craig's List. Hooks right here. Including the recalled version of the Bumbo baby seat, recalled dehumidifiers that can catch on fire, and recalled wooden chests that can trap children inside. I live in fear every day of that happening to my children. The new chairman of the Consumer Product Safety Commission, Elliot Kay, says Craigslist refuses to do what Amazon and eBay do to block the sale of dangerous recalled items. They do not and will not do it to date. What do you say about that? I think that it's morally irresponsible. Craigslist says it has an automated system to help prevent the posting of recalled items. But we were able to post an ad on Craigslist for our recalled Bumbo baby seat, the version without an added safety strap. When we tried to do it on Amazon, the ad was blocked. eBay took our ad down a day after we had posted it. Newmark says he's no longer involved in management, but told the site he founded is accused of being morally irresponsible, putting children's lives at risk. He walked away. We want to get your answers and your side of the story. Is it not possible to get your side of the story? Good to meet you. Thank you. Craig, you don't want to speak about these allegations at all? Craigslist late today told the Consumer Product Safety Commission it's dismayed at the allegations, but asked for an urgent meeting with federal officials, David. Instead saying, nice to meet you. All right, Brian Ross tonight, thank you.